Hi, this is Mr. West, and today we're doing a tutorial video on Halloween Cartesian art. This is from MathDrills.com. Make sure to check out MathDrills. There's lots of great Halloween coordinate plane worksheets, as well as some other fun worksheets, so make sure to check those out as well. In order to do this particular exercise, what we need to do is first understand that we have three separate lines that we're going to have to connect in sequence, and we're also going to know how to graph each one of these points in order to connect the dots. So let's start with how do we read these coordinate points. The first one says 3 comma 3. The first number is your x coordinate and the second number, which is also 3, is your y coordinate. We're going to always start at 0, 0 in terms of where we go. And if we have a negative x, we're moving to the left. Negative y, we're moving down. Positive x to the right and positive y are moving up. So in this first one, we have 3, 3. What we're first going to do is we are going to plot 3 to the right because that first number is 3. And then we're going to plot 3 up because the second number is 3. So let's take a look. I'm going to go ahead and plot that right there. So you see I went 3 units to the right and 3 units up. And I don't put a dot here and I don't put a dot there. That's a common mistake. But I instead put where they'll intersect. It's kind of like reading a map with longitude and latitude. So the second one says 5 negative one that means i'm going to go five units to the right and i'm going to go one unit down because that second number that negative one is the y coordinate that means we move down from the origin the origin is this intersection right here in the middle so again five negative one is right there one two three four five and i move one unit down and then what i'm gonna do is i'm going to connect those lines and that's my start of line one then i'm gonna move on to six negative two eight zero and i'm gonna do all these points in sequence and you're going to see real quick what this looks like if you haven't got it from the thumbnail. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and fast forward uh, through this. These two are pretty quick, these line two and line three. So if you want to pause, slow it down, whatever it is that you want to do, this is for you to follow along with. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I can just finish line one so you can see I connect it and it looks exactly like a back. So now the other two lines are going to be its eyes. Let's go ahead and do those. Okay, there I have it all done. Now, one thing you'll note that it makes a lot of sense to have these two pages on uh, separate pieces of paper. It's really hard to do this if you have to flip back and forth between the two. So having these uh, separate makes it a lot easier. And then I would recommend coloring it when you're, all, when you're all done. It really makes it pop. It recommends different colors for some of the different uh, exercises. I recommend red and then black. But of course, you can make it look like anything you want. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out others like it. Make sure to check out Math Drills. They have tons of great resources and worksheets if you want to look at those. There's the most popular uh, option at the top, and you also can click on the Halloween or whatever season it is. Uh, that'll be a picture up at the top of the menu as well. And whatever your math concerns are, I hope to see you next time right here on West Explains Best.